up with 001.C02. Robotic Picard jellyfish is a robotic jellyfish, which is one of the artificial animals in my current project, organ-machine hybrids. The artificial jellyfish combined a real Picard with electronic devices that allowed the hybrid to be submerged and breathe underwater. A real pig heart returns to life within this machine, a different body. The pig heart pumps by a machine, which is set in two transparent plastic half domes, which are held together with screwed metal bolts and plastic tubes. Human hair is attached around its new body to emulate jellyfish stingers. The reanimated pig heart can be submerged because of programmed software within the body's computer and other components. This programmed artificial movement of the robotic jellyfish is simultaneously displayed with the real movements of the fish and water current in the tank. Sometimes the fish follow and play with the robotic jellyfish, which illustrates the harmony that can occur between nature and machine. The 90-gallon fish tank is decorated with small rocks, an air pump, and different types of lighting. Two red heat lamps serve to regulate water temperature within the tank. The blue lighting below the fish tank theatrically highlights the submerging procedure and also emphasizes the juxtaposition of my artificial creation with the natural creatures. A signal converter with changing numbers monitors the robotic jellyfish by translating signals like a heart rate monitor. The machines therefore animate my hybrid to emulate a living thing. All of the machines and electronic devices make noise. A vacuuming water pump, coupled with electronic relays, sound like a real pumping heart. The air compressor pushes air at a rate that sounds like breathing. Machine noises play a significant role in enhancing the visual environment and atmosphere, as well as illustrating the metaphor of movement within my artificial living thing. The breathing and submerging mechanical systems are controlled by a microcontroller, Basic Stamp 2. The programmed microcontroller regulates the air pressure in the pig heart and the plastic body, as well as the rate of water intake and release, which helps control breathing and submerging speeds. Robotic pig heart jellyfish emulates submarines diving procedures. The robotic jellyfish has a ballast tank that serves as the bottom chamber and allows the operator to change the amount of buoyancy within the body. When the air compressor pushes air into the ballast tank, water inside of the tank is released through the water passage on the plastic panel, which lessens the weight of the body. When the air compressor stops pushing air, water enters through the water passage, which weighs it down because of the difference in water pressure between that of the fish tank and the model. The water level sensor is connected to the microcontroller to send details about the water pressure outside of the body in order to regulate submersion. When the model floats at the top of the fish tank, the water level sensor sends signals to the microcontroller to operate the water vacuum pump and temporarily cut off the air supply, which restarts the submersion process. When the model submerges at the bottom of the fish tank, the water level sensor sends signals to the microcontroller to increase the air supply and to stop the water vacuum pump, which starts to float the model. 
Aqua 001.C02 robotic pig heart jellyfish will evolve continually into different forms as I add new organs and implement new technology. I think uh, the seamless movement is really, really nice, uh -huh. and the flow of the hair is cool in the relation to the fast pumping of the heart, uh -huh. and then you have the live aspects meeting machinery, Yeah. Is it? and the red tone to kind of give it more of a aggressive feel to it, uh -huh. so I enjoy that dialogue going on. Talking to you about animation and how you're interested in animating things that aren't really like live. I feel like it's quite beautiful. The creature you created, it's hard kidneys. Uh huh. Yeah, it's beautiful. Yeah. And the red light is wonderful. You did? Yes, I did. You're kidding. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I like the hair. It really flows and has a jellyfish. Um, aesthetic to it. The color is really nice. Red. Can't believe you got it to work. I like the interaction between the mechanical jellyfish and the real fish. Yeah. Okay. I think you did a really good job on it. Okay, thank yeah. you. <laughs> it has a lot of like dramatic effect too. Uh -huh. yeah. yeah, it's really good. Thanks. Yeah, this is really cool. I like the, uh, the human hair. It really adds the flowy effect to it. Um, it really gives a sort of a jellyfish look to it. Uh -huh. I'm kind of surprised that the uh, the fish can really get along with this this hybrid piece. I, I would think they'd be scared of it or whatnot. Um, it's really really awesome. I like the look of it.